Okay, now it's time to reset our maintenance soon um, light on our dash. <clears throat> I've not found a good source of information on the internet on how to do this with the push button start or a hybrid Camrys that are 2012 and up. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. It took me a long time to figure this out and I didn't even see it in the book. So what you wanna do is we're gonna power the car on with the push button and I am not putting my foot on the brake. So I'm not actually like turning it on. I'm gonna to toggle this guy to trip A. What I'm gonna do is turn it off now. Okay, so now we got it off and we're on trip A. So I'm gonna push and hold in the trip button. It reset it to zero. Now I'm gonna push the power push to start button twice. And it says resetting maintenance data. You can see it's flashing over here. So I'm still holding it up here, flashes all zeros. Boom, we got it. So now I can switch back over to my odometer here. It says hood open, so what I'm gonna do now is we're going to get out here. I'm going to close the hood. So we got the hood closed. We'll jump back in and we're going to pretend like we're getting in to go somewhere. So I'm going to turn, turn it off. And now I'm going to put my foot down on the brake. Start it up. May even put it in reverse here. And you can see we didn't get a light on the dash. So now we're good to go. You can see the engine just kicked on. So there it is, guys. So at this point, now you just want to let it run for a minute. Check under the vehicle for drips. Uh, check your dipstick. Make sure you're right in the marks and the hatch is where you need to be. You don't have any problems. And then you guys have got it. So if you've got any questions or anything, leave them in the comments down below. Thanks for watching, guys.